Hello guys, welcome back to Guitar Tips. In this video, I would like to talk about screen not working properly issues that can be mostly seen in the Realme devices. So let's get started. So first one is always make sure your display is not covered with any kind of oil particles as well as sweat contents. So in order to make it, always make sure you clean your displays all the times. There are chances that the problem is there due to sharing the device screen with another device through the screen sharing option. While using, always make sure that the device is not in the power save mode when it is not necessary. If it is so in the power save mode, you may feel like some heart when it comes to the display. So if you felt like, make it disabled and use it only when you need it. We use screen guard in our devices in order to protect our device. Sometimes the screen guard will be used for a long time and it won't be much, there won't be some kind of damage. So, Sometimes when this touch screen is not working, I better suggest remove the screen guard and check whether it's all fine. Then go for a new screen guard and try it once again. Sometimes if the screen sensors are not working properly, there will be some kind of issue with the touch screen. So make sure the screen sensors works properly. Make sure there is no virus in your phone default memory. If there is an external virus, this may affect the touch screen working in your device. One of the most common screen related problem in Realme devices is when the memory is completely full. So in order to make sure, always check whether the memory is full. So if it is full, delete the unwanted files and try it once again. The very most important one when it comes to device. So we use our device with our bare hands. So if the hands are with oils as well as with moistures or with any kind of dirt contents, the touch screen won't work properly as well as it damage the touch screen. So in order to make sure your hands are free and it is not having any kind of wets and as well as oils. The reason you have to face this problem is nothing but a physical damage on the screen which can be internal. You tried all these things and it still can't figure out, I better suggest you consult an authorized expert. So that's all about when it comes to Realme device when it comes to the screen. So don't forget to subscribe and turn on the bell icon for further notification. You feel free to ask any kind of questions in the comment section. We'll try back our best to get back to you. This is Shahin signing off from Get Your Tips.